Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm just going to be showing you kind of a recent-ish haul of some contacts that I had ordered a while ago. I think just getting colored contacts and all that stuff is really fun. So yeah, I figured I'd want to show you all so you could see um, if you like. Really quickly, just to delve into some of the makeup details that I'm just wearing in case you're curious. Black lipstick is from Ouija Cosmetics, Ouija Cosmetics. And eyeshadow is just Tati palette, but you know, that's not really what this is about. But anyways, let's go ahead and start. So the first contacts that I'm actually wearing right now, hopefully you can see, are the shade Juice Brown. So they are just a really pretty kind of brown color. Totally love them. And then some real quick facts I just realized before I kind of fully get carried away is this is from the brand TT, whoa, TT Dye, I think I believe is how you say it, you can't even see. Um, so every single pair of contacts that you order does come with a contact case. They also do come with, I threw them out because I don't really use them, but it's a little pair of like tweezers, the little plungy thing, and then I think that's it in the case or whatever. Some of them also do come with like little glitters and stuff, which is kind of cool. And, and yeah, it's super simple if you've worn contacts before. They are a bit different. Bummer. I can't find a pair, but, um, what do you call it? The way that they come, they used to, I know for me forever ago when I used to order circle lenses or any kind of different lenses, would come in like a glass vial kind of situation. The ones, at least now that I have seen, no longer come that way. If you have worn like traditional contacts that come in a little like plastic case, they come like that now. It's just a bit bigger. But I think that that is it. Oh yeah, one other random fact. Um, these are good. They do say for a year of wear. It does say, I believe, if you are new to contact, wearing to wear less than four hours. Like right at the maximum of four hours. And then as you get more comfortable, wearing them for a maximum of eight hours. I have worn them before a maximum of eight hours, probably even longer. I feel like this depends if any of you are contact wearers or not. I guess just some things to know about contacts is, you know, depending on how you're feeling or whatever, sometimes you can feel, like, I'll sometimes feel like part of my eyes, like, feeling, you know, more tired or whatever, or just, like, something, it just, like, kind of feels weird, but I feel like that also just has to do with, like, how you're feeling. So, like, if I feel like my sinuses are really bad, like, let's say, like, on this side of my head, then I'll also feel like this eye is also feeling kind of weird. So. Just random, keeping that in mind. Obviously, use at your own risk. Don't do anything crazy. One really nice positive about these contacts is that would, they definitely do have more what I consider slightly expensive, which is $20 contacts. The ones that I bought and I got mine on a discount as well, they were, I think, $9, $10, whatever. I usually just go and, like, you know, go from, like, low to high and see what they have first for, like, budget reasons and just you know because why spend more if you don't have to and then they also had I think when I bought them it was like if you bought I ended up buying 10 pairs because I'm crazy but it ended up being like 60% off or something so like I only paid like $65 including tax for all 10 pairs which I personally feel like was a really good deal I'm happy so far with my purchase and again they're gonna last me an entire year you know obviously I would only technically need one pair and still could last me an entire year but yeah, I'm trying to think. I think that might be all that I need to blab about. Oh yeah, one last thing. So shipping-wise, they do say it takes between 10 to 20 days. I do believe that they come from Hong Kong. I'm not fully sure where. Um, but I thought that's what I read on the website. Mine literally got here way faster than I expected. I think that I don't fully remember, but I believe it was probably within 10 days, if not maybe even a little bit less. Okay, so let's go ahead and get back started with the little uh, showing of the different ones that I have. Okay, so this pair that I'm wearing is the shade Pure Blue. One random thing I realized that I forgot to mention and did want to mention is all of the boxes of contacts. So let me kind of show you. So they come like this, right? Like all of them have their different thing and they all have a sticker on the box. When I went ahead and did is because they are all, the cases are all identical, which kind of sucks. So they're all exactly the same color, all of that stuff. 
So what I went ahead and did is just peeled off the sticker kind of gently, stuck it on the back, so that way I wouldn't have any issues. But anyways, back to the contact. So this is the shade Pure Blue. Also, right, I'm thinking real quick, I feel like this video is going to be so crazy. Um, You might notice that I'm going to look a little like I've been crying because at least from when I pop in contacts, take them out, my eyes kind of water a little bit more or whatever, and obviously using contact solution. Um, but anyways, so these are the pure blue shade. One, the only, like, keep in mind, I guess I would say, is these definitely, you can see there's like a blue kind of like haze around it. They're very beautiful. Do not get me wrong. I super love them. I would just say, obviously, do not expect them to look kind of like a pure blue. Like, if you've ever seen that, like, I think Trixie and Mattel might be a perfect example. They were, like, pure blue, like, solid blue, whereas this, you can still kind of see my eye through it. The blue itself is kind of, it's there, obviously, because, again, you can see it, but just don't expect it to be, like, boom, blue. Anyways, next color. Alright, the next up shade that we have is called Iris Purple 2. It's like a super pretty purpley shade. I actually really like this one. This one gives me, if anybody's seen the original, I think it's the original, um, called The Witches with Angelica Houston, where like a lot of the witches have like purple glow to their eyes. It kind of gives me that vibe, which I really love. Um, but this is another pair that is just, I love these. They are so, they're awesome. I love them. One random thing that I did want to mention, as I'm like literally popping these in, um, that I have noticed from this brand compared to other brands that I've used before, is I've had, I don't know if anybody else has ever had this, but you have color contacts that they just don't feel like they do much to your eyes, whereas this one, for me, I feel like every single shade or whatever does something different for my eyes. So even like the original ones, which are um, Juice Browns, the first pair I was wearing, and they're just like a super light brown. They're almost like a light tan. The contact itself is super light, but it still did something. It's nothing like crazy. Like these, you could almost see, did something different for my eyes. Um, the only bummer I have with these ones, and it could just be my eyes, is that these are called Fisher Green, and you could almost see it's like a super bright kind of green color. Um, I don't really feel like they do anything, like, crazy, you know? I don't know. I think they look pretty, but I feel like they look almost like a deep green. And then also to throw out there, these are the only pair, and I feel bad. Um, no, I don't feel bad, but these are the only pair that I notice will irritate my eyes, as in... Like, I already feel it now. It feels like your eyes are suffocated. Now, like, again, once you take them out, you're totally fine. But I know if ever I've worn them to work and I'm working for at least eight hours, if not longer, I will notice towards the end of my shift that my eyes are just, like, starting to feel... It's hard to say, but it's, like, sore. So I think maybe everybody reacts different to contacts. I know for me, generally, I'll start to feel... Um, almost one eye over the other. It's going to feel more tender. Um, mainly, it's all feel pressure, like, in my temple, like, here. Um, of the eyes, I'm assuming just because my eyes are probably straining. So, at least for this pair, and this is the only one that I have out of the whole collection, that does strain my eyes a little bit. So, just keep that in mind if you were thinking of getting this color. Okay, so this next up one is called Gemini. I have, I don't think I've ever worn it out. I love this one, though. It looks super cool. So they did have, I think, I don't know if I have, like, the right way, though. Ugh. Okay, that looks better. Oh, my God, that looks so pretty, though. Oh, that looks cool. Um, and if you are curious, I feel like you get used to it. I can tell a little bit for the white that there is, like, something there. Don't fully know. Like, my eyes not, like, totally tripping out, but... See... So the screen here, you can tell that it is like full on there compared to when I put those blue ones on before. This one actually completely covers the eye, which I kind of prefer a contact to do that because I, I don't know, I, I feel like if I want a cool color like this, this is what I'm looking for. I though, my eyes look kind of cool. It, I feel like these ones are definitely very, um, 
I almost feel like very like anime kind of doll like. I don't know if it's the fact they have like black on the outside. Um, and they also have stars, if you can kind of see them. I think it's just the fade is really cool. Um, super pretty, super fun. They do have, I think, all of the astrology signs. I wasn't into all of them. I was just into um, this one because it's green and I like green contacts. But yeah, okay, cool. Next pair. Okay, so these next ones are the shade pure green. So I would say, keep in mind, you might notice these ones to me look a lot more green compared to the blue ones, the second pair that I had worn. These, I believe, are along the same, like, idea of collection. So what I was about to say is, like, keep in mind that there, it seems like there is slight inconsistencies, which is unfortunate, but I don't know. I feel like that just happens sometimes, but these ones, I feel like for me, look very green. Super noticeable, very pretty, and yeah, so just keep that in mind. Ugh. Ooh, my eyes are going through it today. Anyways, <laughs> next up I am wearing, oh my god, these awesome ones that are black. I really, 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 really like these. These ones are very comfortable as well. I feel like you would think that some of these would not be that comfortable, but these are like super comfortable. And I really do like them. One thing, though, to note with these ones is when I first put them in, like, originally started getting used to them, you will notice, like, you can almost see, like, a slight shadow, which sounds weird. But because they are circle lenses, you're just realizing you'll be like, oh, I can see a little bit of the black. I don't really notice that with the blue or the green as much, but I do notice it with this one, so just beware. Unfortunately, I do not know the full name of, like, this pair because, sadly... I had tossed the box before, writing it down like a smart person. But anyways, they look like this, just some really pretty uh, black ones. And I like them, and the light reflects like super nice. So I don't feel like they look crazy black, in my opinion. I feel like they look gentle still to me, which I love. Okay, the next pair that we are going to wear are called a Reptile Glow. I absolutely love these. They basically make your eye look like a cat. They are amazing. They are way more comfortable than you would think. Look at my eye. I look amazingly crazy. I love that. Um, the only thing to again, keep in mind, and I don't know if this is just normal with contacts and it, it must be. So when I wear these, they move. And what I mean by that is I'll literally go look at myself in the mirror and I'll look like I'm cross-eyed or like just going crazy because the, uh, what do you call it? The pattern will move. So you look, you go from looking, you can almost see it in this side. You can turn them and see, now my eye just looks like I'm like broken, like a broken doll. Um, if that's the vibe that you want, I love that. I think that's amazing. But I do, at least for these contacts, I will eventually have to try out different brands because I am, like, super curious. Uh, but they do move. And so it is something that if you want this look, which is cool, you know, and different looking, you're going to, at times, look kind of silly when your contact decides to move. And people are going to be like, are you okay? Like, <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with your eye? Um, but yeah, also random. All of these contacts are prescription strength, which is super amazing. You just have to have your prescription from your doctor, all that jazz. And yeah, pretty, pretty easy to get. Let's see. Okay, this hello contact. Thank you. This next pair that I'm going to be putting on is called Donut Green. I kind of want to see if you can tell how like super baby green that looks. But let me go ahead and pop it into my eye. Sorry, that was crazy. <laughs> but you can see between my natural color and the other color how much it actually changes your eye, which I think is, like, super cool. I do really like that. So, like I said, with almost the sheerness of them or whatever, they do, like, work really well. I think it's something, yeah, 
definitely Bravo because again, like I've said, when I've tried other brands, I have been disappointed multiple times. Disappointed a lot when it's supposed to make my eyes look totally different or something. And it doesn't. You know, the point of color contacts is for them to look different. And I would still say that this, to me, looks natural. I think it looks like I have green eyes. My, my, oh, sorry, I'm getting the snuffles now. My, um, my eye color still shows through a little bit, as in, I guess, the, um, pattern or whatever. So, it, to me, it still looks like these are my, um, natural, regular eyes. So, I do really love this pair. All right, the last pair that I'm wearing are actually my personal favorite. I love them. I think they look so pretty. They are called Crystal Ball Blue. I just, I don't know. I think it look, makes eyes kind of almost look um, light blue, slightly leading towards gray. I love the idea of having like gray contacts or something. I don't know. Um, I know they're not fully gray. I'm definitely unfortunate on the colorblind spectrum, but I just think they look super cool. Um, so yeah, okay, let's, uh, oh my god. All right, everybody, so that is the end of this lovely, fun video. I hope that you guys all enjoyed. I really do hope that I gave you some fun um, facts and stuff. If you had any questions about anything, if you have more questions um, for me, I guess, about any of the contacts, whatever, of course, let me know down in the comments description if you also just want to leave me a lovely comment i would love that um feel free to like and subscribe i would love to have you here and yeah i will see you in my next video bye